Hi everyone, I'm Sarah with Madoma, and today I'm here with my daughter, Chloe, and we're going to be talking about something that probably every parent uh, needs to pay attention to, and that's helping teach our children good posture. So before we get started, um, if, if you would like to take advantage of our introductory massage offer, we would love to help you with that. Uh, go to madomamassage.com and we can get you connected with that offer. So, uh, first of all, I just want to say that um, teachers are actually doing a really good job of this these days, but um, they, the, probably one of the best things to do throughout the day is to help your children get up every 30 minutes. I know summer's coming up. I know that there's going to be a lot of TV watching, a lot of game playing, different stuff like that. Um, but if your children can get up and move around about every 30 minutes, that's really going to help. Um, during the school day, teachers do a great job of this, like I said. Um, but definitely that's something that will help. The next thing is uh, we're going to show you a good and bad squatting position. A good squatting position for children, except like when, when they're playing around and different things, is actually a, a really good way to build their back muscle and help their posture. So Chloe, do you want to go ahead and show me a poor posture position whenever you're squatting? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. See, let's, let's move the camera just a little bit. There we go. Her back's kind of rounded. And Chloe, show me a good squatting position. There we go. Knees together. Okay. And you can just reach out in front of you. There you go. Just like that. Now I want you to turn so everybody can see your back, what, what I'm talking about for a good squatting position. So you just lean over just a little bit like you're playing. You can just look at me, baby. Good. Okay, see how her back is nice and straight? Um, if you can get your children to, if you can get your children to maybe play in this position even for a few minutes at a time, that's actually really, really going to help them. So the next way is going to be, you can sit back up in the chair, baby. Okay, very, very good. The next way is going to be the proper way to get our children to have good posture when they're eating. Now, I will be honest. This goes against everything that I have taught my children, um, but it's actually it's actually really helpful for their posture. So hang on real quick. Here we go. So so we have taught our children to lean over your plate, don't get crumbs everywhere. Um, that is actually, it actually can really hurt their back whenever they're um, leaning over and trying to eat. So Chloe, can you show me a poor posture position for eating, a bad posture position for eating? Good. Kind of slump over, yeah. You're slumping over your plate, good. Her head's forward, that forward head posture, um, yep. Exactly. All right, now Chloe, can you show me a good posture whenever you're eating? Okay, and show me what you're, what you're supposed to do with your food. You're supposed to, yep, you're supposed to bring food up to your mouth whenever you eat. So, <laughs> of course I give her cookies, the most crumbly thing ever. Um, <laughs> but she actually did really, really well, honey. Um, so yeah, so, so the more that we can get our kiddos to actually bring food up to their mouths, um, it really helps build those back muscles and helps them have good posture. So um, this next thing is going to be for devices. Give me just one second. Okay. So whenever your kiddos are sitting on the sofa, when they're sitting in a chair, you're going to want to have a pillow, a good size pillow about this size, um, in front of them on their lap. And Chloe, I want you to show me here. Let's turn to the side. There we go. I want you to show, show me poor posture for playing with your device. Yep, exactly. And that's what, that's what they, yep, mm-hmm. Good. Now show me good posture for playing with your device. Good. Now you can see... The pillow is used to prop it up. It's more out in front of her. Her head is still down, um, but posture is a lot better. Sit up just a little bit. Yeah. <laughs> Good girl. Okay, and so that will really help um, build those, those core and back muscles. All righty, let's see. The, net, the last one that we're going to go over is how to sit in a chair properly. So let me go ahead and take this, sweetie. 
Okay, you want to stand up for me? So first of all, having a, a nice firm chair as opposed to the one I'm sitting in is really cushy. Um, having a nice firm chair is, is always better um, for helping your kiddos have good posture. This one has a tiny pad on it. It's not that, um, it's not that, it's, it's still firm, but it still has a little bit of a pad. Um, you can come back in. Okay, and so, uh, so typically, when, whenever kiddos will sit down in a chair, they'll just kind of sit down and slump down. So, show, Chloe, can you show that to me? <laughs> yeah, very good. Very good. All right, now I want you to stand back up. Okay, now, um, whenever you're to get the best posture for sitting in a chair, I want you to get your kiddos to put their bottom all the way back first. Good. Now sit up. There we go. Now sit up. Good. Very good. Very good. And you can see her, her knees are out front. Her feet are almost flat on the floor. Um, this is a really good posture for kiddos. So um, thank you so much for tuning in. Um, you can just sit down now, baby. There you go. And um, thanks so much for tuning in. I always love to um, expand and, and um, help out as many people as we possibly can, including our kiddos. So um, we would love to help you. If you're in any kind of pain or discomfort, if you have felt stuck in the past, um, like maybe you've tried everything, you've gotten massages other places, you maybe have, uh, have headaches or neck aches, back aches, any kind of pain in your body, um, you will really benefit from medically integrated massage. You can go to madomamassage.com Madoma and find out more details about your introductory massage offer. So thank you so much, and everyone have a wonderful weekend. Say bye, Chloe. Bye.